What else we can do with planes? And first, I want to show you one of my favorite tricks with this program. We are using one section plane, the move mode, and then I want to choose in selection tree the first flaw in this, in this model, in the structure model, and then I can press fit selection and selection plane changing to to show us only the elements uh, in this floor. So this function uses the borders of the elements which are located in this layer on this um, level and make this position to the border of these elements. It's very useful when you know how you modeled your, your structure. And the same thing, the other things. We are going to observe its rotation. Rotation is pretty simple. We only should to rotate model on. Ok, rotate model on. Then we can press left button and to change the, the position. It's pretty simple. Pretty simple. And if you want, you can do it precisely with this button. Yeah. And as you, if you want, you can activate the second one, the second one, and change the position of this plane, line to surface, for example, like this one. And now, oh, sorry, and let's back to move. Move to surface like this one. And using two or more planes, we can get any kind of model view. And we can turn off this, this item of plane. We only should press the move. And now we can get the scene with all the section planes, but without this icon. And now you know that you can move planes align them to surfaces, you can rotate, you can fit, and you can get every kind, any kind of view using all these things. And if you want, you can use all the six planes to make everything what you need.